here again part two of my heist gta online heist about to start this mission with lester see what he has to say see what kind of offers he got to offer me so yeah let's let's get into this and see what's going on uh, yes come in come in it's uh good to see you again uh in a while <laughs> yeah I've never been good at small talk. I don't have many friends. Uh, I do sometimes meet people online, and then I arrange to meet them out in the real world, and then I go there, but I just I hide, and I watch them, and I think, wow, now you are experiencing 1% of what I felt my entire childhood when I spoke to a girl. Wow. I've never told anyone that before. <laughs> Feels good to talk. <laughs> so, uh... <clears throat> I know you've been complaining, but you weren't ready. Now, maybe, just maybe you are ready to do real work. I mean, are you interested? Because if you are, I have a few things uh, coming down the wire soonish. If you want, I'll contact you. But don't let me down on this. I'm putting my neck on the line, and I like my neck. It's my best feature. Aside from my sparkling conversation. Okay. First, there will be a contact about the job soon. All right. Come on with it, Mr. Lester. I'm ready for action. So now we're about to get this phone call from Lester. I'm gonna answer it, see what he says. Right. We might be ready to see what he's saying. Thing. If you want to work, you'll get a knock on your door any minute. Oh, I gotta go to my house. Good thing I'm on the street. I'm down the street, I mean. Mm -hmm. All right, here it is. I'm about to get started. So, if you're asking why, if you're just sitting there wondering why I'm here in this store, when GTA, when GTA Heist is available right now. I'm just here because I'm going to rob this store. Because the servers keep knocking me offline. So. I know the drill, okay? I'm going to make my own heist. Give me the money, man. Just give me the money. Go faster, man. Come on, man. Just give me the money. Better be. Or I'll be back. Yeah. GTA Heist. Edge and Action Edition. Just robbed. What's the what's the name of that store? Rob's Liquor. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Rob's Liquor just got robbed. <laughs> So I'm gonna try this again because I tried to do it at first, but it said it failed to download the app, the job. So I'm gonna try this again after I lose the cops. All right, so I'm gonna try this again, guys. Hopefully I don't get booted off the servers. Okay, finally I made it to the screen. About to get started, you guys. GTA heist. Uh, yes, yes, this will uh, do very nicely. Very nice place you've got. Very uh, chic. <laughs> Nothing like a bourgeois bank robber to remind me of how strange Los Santos has become. Still got that earpiece. The psychos at least had the dignity to be psychotic. Nowadays, it's all about uh, home furnishings and going straight. 
Alright, you ready? Because this is it. Well, it's, it's not it, but uh, it's something, it's something uh, very big. And not quite ready yet, but I wanted to uh, see how you're doing. What I've got is a Felisa Bank franchise. And it's nothing too complicated. There's no buy-in. Now, normally, there would be a buy-in. You would put in money up front, we would arrange oh, the job, looks ready. and you would pull it off. But this time, I'll uh, cover the upfront costs. Call it the uh, price of getting a look at you. And there's no risk to you. Unless, of course, you count uh, getting locked up or shot. <laughs> so, you ready? And what do you think? Do you uh, have questions, comments, concerns? All right. What are you waiting for? Let's go see this place. Really good job, scope out. Let's head to let's get to the car so fast. <coughs> get in. Take us to the on Western Highway near Tumash. Word of warning: we're on the job right now, so don't let the cops notice you. If they come after us, we call it off. Understood. So, my taciturn friends, I suppose you want to know how we're doing this. Well, funny you should ask. We're driving out to the bank, taking a look at it, picking up some equipment, and then heading back to make our plans. Not very complex at all. We're not going in, we're not poking it with a stick. We're just sitting back, taking a look. You see, uh, I like my... God damn it. Hey! I like my scores, like I like my dates. Across the street and unaware they're being watched. <laughs> Alright, so why this bank over Lester. all the other banks in the state? Why does fortune you favor this again, one? Lester? Another good question. You're full of good questions. You're like a child whose parents think it's clever, or the IRS. Oh. Well, this bank's got some safety deposit boxes, and in one of those safety deposit boxes are some bonds being hidden from the tax man that no one's going to report missing. All starting to uh, make sense. Security should be light. Well, relatively light. Light if your daydreams are raids on the Union Depository. Quite heavy if your day job is turning over liquor stores and gas stations. And the bonds in the box will be worth more than a few rumpled notes from a till, so the minor escalation is worth it, if you can handle it. Plus, you know, the sea view. <laughs> Nothing like staring at the ocean while you contemplate money, power, incarceration, homicide. Yeah, all those weighty issues surrounding your first foray into serious armed robbery. I'm assuming you're kind of a cerebral crew, because otherwise this whole not talking deal just kind of puts you on the spectrum, right? <laughs> okay. Well, how about we just get there and see where we're at? Yeah, let's just do that. So that's the Fleeker Bank. There it is. Take a look. Drink it in. I know how many times I passed by the bank. Myself. Take a look. Uh, what are we looking at? Um, small joint. Not much security. Staff won't give a crap. <laughs> Especially about the deposit boxes. Customers will probably be thinking uh, how to turn this into a screenplay. <laughs> the boxes <laughs> are in the back behind the safe door. We want box number 167. Yeah, it's right on the highway with good access. That works for you. you get out quick, but it'll also work for the cops. Speed up their response time. Okay? Okay. We've seen what we're gonna see. Let's go to the garment factory. Now, when you hit the bank, you're gonna need to hack into its security system. I've written a neat little program that'll do most of the work for you, but it's probably a good idea for you to familiarize yourselves with it. You, in the passenger seat, I've sent it to your phone. Take it for a dry run, keep your hands steady, and maybe the wet run won't be a disaster. So this is the... <clears throat> this is the planning stage of the, of the heist. It's all intense and stuff. So. Wait until we actually get it done. And I'm still I'm still a little nervous about it too. I just feel like it's man, this shit feels real this shit. <laughs> this is real, this is real. <laughs> I'm 
calling Paige. She's my assistant. First she's gonna get us what we need, then she's gonna sell me in half. <laughs> Shut up, Lester. No? Didn't like that one? Uh, you don't make it easy. Paige, it's Lester. The place looked good. Nothing we weren't expecting. Can you get the intel together? Hard copies to go on a notice board. Yeah, plus all the equipment we spoke about. I'll be over to collect it with uh, those people. Yeah. Mm, charming as ever. Okay, see you soon. What do you mean, those people? Just loading the hardware into the back of a truck. Hmm. Tools for the job, things for you to wear. On a job, your attire will depend on the role you're performing. As a job gets more complicated, so will the uniforms. If you're likely to be seen by civilians, you'll be provided with a couple of masks. Then, when you go into the bank, you can choose one that uh, goes with your eyes. <laughs> and hey, there's the added bonus of none of your favorite comic convention outfits being linked to a major crime. <laughs> whoop de doo uh, where were we? Ah. Okay. Look at Masks. Paige. Oh, yeah. Uh, we'll go over there, pick her up, and go back to your place to plan this thing. I can talk you through the planning board later. That might be helped by a visual aid. The rest is pretty self-explanatory. Listen to me. Do what I say. Bullets go in here, come out there. And if you're ever caught, you keep your mouth shut. <laughs> that couldn't be good. Move. There she is. Leave my car here, take the truck. Hey, passenger seat. Did you get into their network? No? Well, you better do better next time. Nice to meet you. He's driving this time. Now it's back to the apartment. Hope he's a good driver. Is it all there? I think so. You want to get out and check? Go down the inventory? Or are you happy sitting there making a perfect butt imprint in your easy wipe seat? I'll take your word for it. <laughs> Thank you. It should all be there. The clothes. That dude got his mask on already. He ready. Masks, he's tail, ready. <laughs> This guy's hey, name. I'm not sending a friend request. Nice little conspiracy to commit robbery charge waiting to happen. <coughs> what, did they charge us with thought crime? Not so much thought as everything but the deed crime. We'd be caught with our pants down and a hard on out to here. Well, we're not <laughs> getting caught. These are professionals. So I hear. The cheapest professionals money can buy. I like to think of it as investing in new talent. And until you and me start playing low rent Bonnie and Clyde, that's the way it's got to be. She didn't mean anything by that, by the way. Uh, she's just a little brusque. If they were offended, they would have said something. Got a trophy. Be prepared. That's right. Always be prepared, guys. Especially in the world of GTA. Set up past. Got a platinum? I've never got a platinum before. Yeah, so that was it, guys. My first job for GTA Online Heist. The setup for Fleeker Bank. There will be more to come, so stay tuned.